ready when you are. Okay. Gary, 9-0 in the end, pretty comfortable evening for your side, but was it about much more than the result? Yeah, like I said, you know, we've come away for a few days. It's perfect for me, a, a nice little club, very, very friendly, and it's nice for us to, for them, it's a big game for them, and it, it's nice to us to show a little bit of respect back to them that what they've given us in the few days, the people of Oakham, and um, yeah, it's, it, it's lovely, you know. Um, so we've gone one better than, than losing last week, 8-0, it? so it's nice to bounce back 9-0. But uh, it's good, it's a good workout for the lads, you know, obviously it's about the fitness and, you know, just... Um, getting to know how we're going to play a little bit and you know I thought it was good actually. Yeah I, I agree with everything you said there actually. How did you put together your first starting 11? What, what thoughts went through your mind? Well there's a, there's a few needed a few more minutes than others because they haven't they've not had too too much and you know we needed to see a couple of players in in certain positions and what they're about and I just thought everybody you know went about the jobs very very well and and you know we when, we, when we're in there and you play games like this, particularly when you score a few goals, it sometimes then becomes more difficult to keep the tempo going. But I thought we'd done that. Um, although it's 9 0, fair play to them, you know, they, they, they kept going. It wasn't a farce. You know, I know it sounds it, 9 0, but it wasn't. Um, hopefully, we can get a few more free kicks around the box with Josh Laws. Every free kick he takes is scoring. So, uh, his first one's superb, ab superb, absolutely magnificent. Um, well, three different free kicks as well. He's got three goals at each yeah. of them. It's been different. Yeah, ab absolutely, yeah. So, no, it was nice, you know, but whatever pre season is all about, we're, we're preparing for a week on Saturday, and that's what it's all about. It's been a beautiful day. It was like winter yesterday, summer today, and, you know, it's, it's, I, it's, I think it's lovely to come to, to clubs like this. I, I, I absolutely do. And, um, you know, hopefully not only us getting something out of it, but, but they have as well. And this could prepare you for what you may come up against in, say, a second quarter round of the FA Cup or something like that. Yeah, yeah, you do. You know, that's 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 what it's about. So uh, we've tried to mix pre-season up, you know, with some with some tough games and and some some easier games on paper, if you like. And you know, either either way, whoever you play, you've got, you've got to go about it um, and prepare yourself in the right way. And we've done that. Has anyone pressed their case for inclusion in your starting eleven against Telford? Yeah, I, you know, I've, I've seen things in, in certain players, but I, I, I've put a squad together where no matter who's playing, I think, you know, they're going to give us absolutely everything and we know what we're going to get. But, you know, there's certainly a few lads, you know, like like Kane with his pace again tonight. And, um, you know, he's just seems like he's tweaked his going a little bit. So I'm hoping that's not too bad. But, you know, obviously with his pace, gives us something a little bit different. Um, you know, Connor's in there, he, he, you know, he's a workhorse. No matter where, wherever you play him, he's... He gets the ball back very, very quickly for you, which you need that as well, you know, when we lose the ball. And, and then, you know, he's, he just keep, keeps the game simple. Uh, so a lot, a lot of different things from a, from a lot of players. And, um, you know, it's, uh, like I say, it's about a week on, a week on Saturday. We've got Notts County on, on Saturday and then we've got Bradford 23s on Tuesday at the training ground just to, to go over the last few things. And then off we go again. Theo Wharton had to come off relatively early in that game. How bad is his injury? No, not overly bad. He just went over on his ankle a little bit, so not not overly bad. Um, you know, Amari and um, Louis picked up knee injuries. Uh, Louis in particular should should be back for Saturday. Probably not Amari. So you know, there's with Kane with his going as well. There's three strikers, so we don't want to start losing losing players. Uh, I don't think they're anything serious, but. Um, you know, we don't want to start start losing a few players at this stage. And you've played your two games now on this trip. You've still got one more night, though. How important is the stuff away from the football being to the group? Yeah, massive again, you know. We, we, we've, we had, we've had time together. We've we've had a few little competitions. You know, we, we've we've been getting up at uh, 7 in the morning to go to go training, which is something something a little bit different. And you see, see which players like to get up in the mornings and those that don't. And... You know, for the first time in their lives, some of them have only seen one seven o'clock, so they've seen two seven o'clocks now, and um, so it's it's been good. It's been good. Everything about it's been good. Like I say, we've we've got a few hours left tonight. You know, we're gonna we're gonna go and have a have a drink with the the people of of Oakham now, and um, and finish the trip off nicely.